Uh, here we go. Yeah, yeah. Slowly oh. zooming out. Hi. Wait a minute. Yes. Wait, stop the show. Like, oh my God. Like, stop, the like, stop the fucking show. Stop the show. Stop the show. Stop it. Stop the show. Hey, what's up, bud? We've just don't, discovered don't something extremely so. strange. <laughs> yeah, please. Please go for it. Junie, tell them what you found. Judy. Okay. <clears throat> um, all right. Thanks for gathering with me today. I found out that on uh, Forge, or at least Foundry, uh, maybe other web applications, but specifically this one, your, uh, your zoom in and zoom out, like on your scroll wheel, cover slightly different... Uh, amounts of space like it's one pixel off it's a real bummer so if you scroll in out in out just one click at a time you will slowly zoom out one pixel at a time what it's real it's real what does that mean just tested it keeps zooming in and out just oh slowly one bump at a time and you'll see you slowly zoom out oh oh man yeah, well, this ruined Forge for me. We should go back to roll 20. Yeah, let's go back to roll 20. <laughs> At least there the zoom fucking worked. <laughs> I don't understand. I don't, maybe I never got it. I think it's also because I'm using stream camera, so it's like, you know, I'm able to like move stuff around here. Just don't don't worry about yeah, it. Yeah, maybe. Don't, don't worry. Just don't do that. <laughs> don't worry. I can carry this burden for us. You can. I don't know about everyone else. I'm like frothing at the mouth quietly. I know you are, bud. <laughs> this is like the one thing you asked we us just... not to do, and here we are doing it, you know? I just need you guys to be really brave, okay? I just need you to be brave for me. Let's just go yeah. to Fantasy Grounds. The you guys want to hit- The time for bravery is mm. gone. The time for <laughs> outrage is <laughs> gone. We're just going to bring back Fantasy Grounds. That was a map uh, that you Ooh. could use back in 2003, I want to say. Ooh. Yeah, we'll just bring that back. Yo, I don't know what that is. But yeah, cool. I, I know you don't. I know you don't. Oh, yeah, I was like four. Yeah, I think. it was before your fucking time. No, I know. I know. It's fine. I get it. He's calling you a Zoomer. I know. You a Zoomer. I know. And I'm looking back at him defiantly. <laughs> yeah, I was four, Grandpa. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Oh, I know. oh no! I was graduating oh. high school Wait, while you were what? in fucking diapers. Yeah, no, I know, I know. Doing what? I'm <laughs> I'm not following. Wait, what? What? Where? When? When were you? Well, man, you are not on our wavelength <laughs> right now, buddy. You just. Well, man. Well, man. I'm not. That's hey. why I'm trying to catch up right now. Hey. Yeah. What? <laughs> hey, buddy. Hey. What's going on? Hey. Hey. It's let's get the. Hey, hey guys. Let's, get, let's remove the stink it's a little okay. bit, you know? We used to I got be friends. I got a little smoothie right now. I'm chilling. Okay. Ooh, that sounds nice. Yeah. We're just we're just talking about what a baby a juniper is. I'm used to it. And what a Whatever. what well, a yeah, not I mean, baby tomato was, is. Even though they're like the same because age. you guys were like, aha, <laughs> Junie's a zoomer, but she's the one who claims to be a zoomer. So I was just trying to I was trying to catch back up. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think mm -hmm. I th I think I think there was a assumption that I was uh, subtweeting uh, Junie as a Zoomer. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. You mean sub zeding? So. Uh, Shut up! <laughs> I cringe, dude. <laughs> I fucking cringe. Can't what wait, do you mean, guys. You gotta be. Can't be wait. Here. Can't <laughs> wait till I'm not on social media until until I say fuck it. We're just gonna do Discord. Who cares? <laughs> god damn the moment i think i saw news is like soon you have to like actually like register your id on that I think site that was for like verified accounts only oh uh, okay I was so like, you can like it's not in like you oh don't gotcha have to. okay cool 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 awesome great yeah. i don't get it anyways uh there's <laughs> lena i point at lena i i shove her in front of the stage hey what's up dude hey. how's, how's it going Cool. Hi, Lena. What's your hot take on all this? <laughs> what are you What are you vibing with? What do you? Yeah, feeling? do you agree or do you disagree? Yeah, yeah, yeah let us know I, if yeah, you yeah, disagree or agree. <laughs> agree to disagree. Oh. Agreeingly. Ooh, Ooh I don't okay. like that. That's no. Don't yeah. give her that. That's that's no. the most. Half there's a, there's thing a ever. nice. I can see how comfortable that seat is there on the fence, <laughs> and it's fine. You can stay there. She's it's playing right. both sides so that she never loses, but we can all tell. Oh, I can. It reeks. Oh my god. Leave right. Yeah. Get off the fence. Okay. 
Uh, you guys want to do a little recap? Yeah. Yes, yes. please, God. <clears throat> All right, let me drink some water. God, that. Oh yeah. That would be awful if I like point at one of you. It's like you you do the recap, and it's like no. No, <laughs> I've had that happen to no, me. That would be Matter of so fact, funny. I had you it happen to me fucking <laughs> weekly on Joe's streams. Okay, <laughs> I've been there. <laughs> and it's bad. It's really bad. It's really bad out here. I mean, I would, I would love it if I could do that. But I know sometimes he'd friends. make us fight. He'd make everyone fight for it, and he'd be have like, a, have a fun little roll off. Fucking no do a roll off to see who gets punished in front of everyone. That's so funny. <laughs> like, a fucking, like a sicko. You're gonna win the prize. You're like, I don't want to win <laughs> the prize. Roll the dice. All right. <laughs> no, that that made my life so much easier because I have to talk all uh, all session anyways. If I can point at some, that's why I uh, in in the Shedda's breach we have Naomi and Naomi loves doing recaps. So I'm like, you're the recap person. Here it is. Thank you, because I never want to like just push that on someone because um, <laughs> it's miserable and I hate it. Uh, anyways, here we go. Smiles uh, smiles uh, looks at camera. Uh, recap. Dude, he hates doing this. I hate it. All right, let's zoom out a little bit. Zoom skis. Uh, so in the last session, during the last day, you guys kind of uh, split apart, did a little bit of mischief, a little bit of mayhem, kind of did your own thing. Uh, we separated with. Let me go ahead and go down the list. Bo heard about a, a boba place uh, that he wanted to go ahead and check out. You went ahead and did that. You did something. Oh yeah, that's right. You transformed it into abomination and everyone dropped their boba and it, I think the place is pretty much closed right now because of that monstrosity that seems to have scared everything else over there. But you did get a couple of uh, uh, cups of boba that was left behind, which was mm -hmm. wonderful. Mm -hmm. um, unfortunately, you did immediately drop that once you discovered uh, that Drask and the bomb managed to recover michael wave oh well, now, boy that's and that's that's your your new love now how did that heck that happen well these two were create mischief kind of hopping her oh no yeah i have to bring up this bad news so you guys uh went over to the market tent and because weeks had turned to months and my brain is so old and so soft uh the name that the mechanic gave you was actually not eli because i forgot Eli was using his code name so that people wouldn't start uh. shit. <laughs> uh. And he uh, was right about that. But I, I think it's fair to say you all probably would have done the same thing anyways. It's, yes, it's fair to say that regardless of the name said, the Bob <laughs> would have said they were some kind of psychomaniac yes. so as to get a discount on whatever he was trying to get. <laughs> Absolutely. Com common DML? Absolutely. 100%. My brain can only hold so much You're information. You corrected this before, by the way. You're oh, like... oh, no, I corrected you guys offline. I'm letting oh, the I'm, okay. yeah, I'm letting the audience know and let you guys know now um, so I can own my mistake. And also so uh, people aren't like, but what about this? And I'm just like, oh, yeah, we're good. Everything's good. Everything's been resolved. So, <clears throat> excuse me. And then meanwhile, uh, Zug and Felsic, you guys went to a little film festival and it was a cute, cute ass time. Um, did you buy like a little knickknack? I think you were going to buy a scallop um, because oh my God. Felsic I don't know. saw. I was just bullshitting. Yeah, yeah. Little, yeah we got some, matching it was, scallop necklaces. It was some BS that Juni made up. But yeah, it was awesome. And really <laughs> yeah, it was some shit that I literally yeah. made up on the spot. <laughs> really just dashing no, the um, magic everyone's like it was such a sweet moment you're like some bullshit i don't know everyone's no, like no. it was i think it was a sh it was a shell necklace yeah no it was like a scallop, it was a scallop. Be because, it was a scallop because you it said it's like you what the scallop yeah because felsic says it reminds me of you zug and you're like oh yeah it reminds me of you because you're always in your shell and felsic was like what the fucked up thing to say to someone <laughs> by the way wild so thing to say so it was funny. like i meant because of your hat what the fuck <laughs> and then you went to a film festival and you you saw a chi documentary um where you saw a bunch of people die to the chi uh, and then you saw a little bit of a documentary about uh about div and the history of 
of Braun and how he became uh, essentially the immortal king, I think was the official title to it. But he was the last all king uh, of Alabaster um, before one day he had vanished. He just he left the kingdom one day and never returned. And that was what the movie was about. So we learned a little bit about that. Uh, and then finally all gathered up. It's about eight in the uh, evening now as the sun is slowly starting to set. Uh, you'll be over here at the Spark Peak uh, where the goblin who had run ragged, drenched in sweat, uh, dehydrated and exhausted uh, would have uh, come up to you all. It's like, ah, okay, I think I found who you were looking for. And uh, what you were looking for uh, was some evidence of Kem who is a known associate or believed to be an associate of uh, Rain Thames, uh, who you are hunting down for a big old bounty. As a friendly recap of Rain Thames and why you're hunting them down. Uh, a, it's a bounty and it's worth a lot of credits. Uh, but B, the reason why there's a bounty out on him is uh, he's a bit of an ecological terrorist uh, that goes and blows up a lot of these rigs, a lot of the um, corporations that are around to process and, and gather energy from Europa. Um, Rain isn't too kind on that, so he typically uh, blows up a lot of these installations, kind of sinking them down so that Europa can remain free without like mechanical and technological influence uh the problem is when rain does this a lot of innocent people get hurt or worse are killed uh and so the ionian and european authority definitely wants rain to to to, to be a, to, to be arrested to, to 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 be brought in um and uh yeah so that's why you guys are currently on this bounty um you've also been given a side mission which i know you guys aren't doing now um, to get an engine uh, from a European, from a European like shipyard, uh, but that's something you're holding off for later. And uh, and yeah, but you, this goblin that you cast suggestion on, would return to you. This is like, yeah, okay, I, I found some people. They say he's like, he's got an apartment or, or something. Or his, uh, oh, what was the location called? Oh, right. And then he's just thinking, 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 thinking. And then it's like, over to the south. There's a, there's a volcanic island there. And then I pull up my notes. Uh, to Todrona. Oh, there's Todrona. It's a big volcano island. And, uh, and, uh, there's a, there's a, there's a huge, uh, a huge steel island as well, manufactured island, uh, where a lot of workers are there. And I, I heard, in my understanding, uh, that Cab lives there. That's where his apartment is. That's where I heard from this guy. <sighs> wow, that's really good information. Wow. Yes. Uh, so if Very we just go good. poke around over there, we could probably find somebody who knows them. Yeah, probably. <sighs> I'm very thirsty. Yeah, can we send this guy on his way he's kind of creeping me out yes you can scamper off now never to return yeah go on go on now he nods and walks away never to return oh <laughs> um. i'll <laughs> miss that mpc <laughs> <laughs> bye goblin you did well hope we didn't ruin oh. your life too much um so yes, uh, now the next thing to know, so now you know that uh, Kim's apartment is over in the region of Todrona somewhere. Perhaps if you gather some information around that area, uh, you may be able to, to do something about it. But Can for now, look at a map. the stage is yours. Uh, yes, give me one second. I have to remember where exactly you are on the map. So, map time. Uh, let me also enable true vision. True vision. True vision. Yo, is there like a lot of volcanic islands? Oh yeah. Ooh. Okay. Interesting. N yeah. Um. And what that's the? and that's because motherfucker. Motherfucker. Give me a second. Hey. True vision makes me <laughs> nothing but blind. There's I something know. kind of there's something poetic about that. A little wacky about <laughs> true vision. When you can see it all, yeah. truly you just see nothing. <laughs> oh. Uh I think you oh. really said something there. Oh, that's why. Something. Or maybe something no, like No, I said you nothing. Know, 
a blind man sees you for what you truly are, or something. You're like, nothing. You're, you know, sees <laughs> nothing. <your> soul. <laughs> nothing at all. Or nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. There is so much shit here. R what? Okay, fine. Whatever. Here, I'm just gonna do this. Okay. So, what the frick? All right. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm, I'm figuring this out. Okay, so fire exploration. Let's check. Token vision. Nope. Uh, global. Yep. No, no vision limitation. I'm just gonna drag your tokens. I ain't got time for this. Good luck out there, boss. Hey, thanks. Fight. Fight. Do we have the same Fight. amount of digits in our toes as we do our fingers? Oh, that's. Huh? Huh. I mean, uh, I think yeah. a lot of animals do, though. Oh, like, wait. Aren't... You guys can see this, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, my fucking God. I thought. Yeah, that's what I was saying when you were uh, like, uh, when you yeah. gave us vision and I went blind. I could see all right. Before. All right. So here's what happened. Here's what happened. <laughs> I thought the fog of war was on and it was just saying like, oh, yeah, you can kind of like see the map. And I forgot. I have an add-on where the time of the day actually changes how bright or dim the map is. It's 8.43 Whoa. at night. So that's why it looks faded like that. I'm silly. Mm. I'm a silly little guy. Anyways, you guys are currently, um, if I am correct, uh, kind of like around... Oh, no, sorry. You're around these parts, right? This is where you are. This is J uh, Jashore uh, that you guys are currently at. Um, to get over to Tadrona, uh, you will need to sail, or however you decide to go, um, to over here. Because this section, along with the volcanic island, is Tadrona. This is where the mechanical, uh, this is the, the, um, the manufactured island where everyone lives. And then there is a, a big volcano over here with some mining operations going on to gather the thermal energy that is there. <laughs> so that so so that's where you're at. So it's like a little southwestish. <laughs> Does that help, law man? Understood. Yes. Excellent. I reload the 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 Jashore region map. So all we have to do is simply go there and ask again. Yeah, but that's like across the bay, right? We're gonna have to find a boat or something. We can swim, right? What if we find an underwater boot while we're at it? Do we simply want to walk up to the nearest dock and ask about boats and underwater boats? Maybe we can... Maybe we'll get lucky. And just find yeah. an underwater one right there. Yeah. yeah, maybe we'll get lucky. <laughs> when can Bo do that, like, transform thing where it just gets, like, really big and stringy and noodly? Like, because we were going to do that, because I imagine if he gets big enough, so people just, like... <laughs> Get on oh, my back, ew, my head. Like, no, I don't think so. <laughs> I, I, dude, I used. You remember how long I used to be before, man? It's. It, I swear to God, it, it's no, in my head. I don't want to ride the boat. Even in your stretchy, <laughs> stretchiest of, uh, <laughs> of 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 abilities, I would say your buoyancy uh, leaves much to be desired. Wait, so uh, like, oh my God, like the Mrs. Incredible boat? Like, yes, that's, oh, that's what I'm talking yeah, about. Yes, is. exactly. Oh yes. my God. No, I've, I, I've been here before with these, like, can I wild shape into a fucking wagon? All right, you don't want to go down this dark path. <laughs> Wait a minute. What? No, no. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. No, 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 Bo. All it's going to take is for one slightly larger than average fish to come up beneath you, bite you, and then we all drown. That is true. Yeah. You are. Yeah, but true. We, we would we would figure it out when we Wait, get there. You know. Wouldn't. I don't just, know about that. Just to be, <laughs> like fair. Mm -hmm. If we saw a big fish, couldn't they turn into a big fish? Uh, if it was a beast within the challenge rating, yes. Okay. But typically, yeah. those big fish uh, are beyond the challenge rating limit of a druid. Mm, okay. Mm. Yeah, not yeah. so big fish. Yeah, oh. the kind the, the kind of fish that are around Europa, if you encounter them, are within like CR fifteen, CR twenty. Like they are. Oh. There's no way. Oh. <laughs> good, 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 good. Yeah, hey, that should be fine. Yeah, I can't cool. wait to that's vote cool, in this session and watch Brett make <laughs> rolls. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, no, are, are you guys cool with just getting like a dinky little like canoe or something? <laughs> like, I'll tell you what, when Drask and I were. Uh, Back on the main island, uh -huh. uh, I saw plenty of boats out in the yeah. commercial district. 
Well, yeah, but like those are probably owned by someone. Ah, that hasn't stopped us before. Them. Let's oh, borrow them. Yes, I'll just. Uh, we can just yeah. tell them we're borrowing them. Uh, yeah, all right. I don't want a ship. I don't want a boat. I want a fancy ship. We can <laughs> definitely you get have the a fancy ship. ship. <laughs> so, I, no. I have a fancy. Hey, where? What? Huh? No, no, no. Like a ship. You know. Sorry, that was out of character. <laughs> <laughs> what was? Huh? <laughs> Why don't we just ask around and see if anybody knows of any rentals? And if nobody knows of any rentals, then we can get creative, okay? Okay. 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 Uh, can, we, can we do the, uh, you know, we all put our paws and hands and goop in. We go, we go, to, go team, you know, before we go. Good, good luck. No, I'm good. I'm also <laughs> all set on that. I think if I touch any of you, you start to get sick. Uh, anyways. Uh, yes, I can walk up the... to the nearest person. <laughs> he gets Michael's little little tiny hand, and he puts oh. it forward, and I put my tiny raccoon hand, and go, uh, go, go, team. <laughs> uh. Uh, the head, uh, my Michael wave squeaks a little bit. Wait, Falsic squints at the hedgehog. Wait, you guys got a hedgehog? Oh Where yeah. Did you get it? That's the hedgehog. Yeah, you, yes. You, did, you, did you say hedgehog? Hey, look at this guy. Bo like holds him up in the air like the sacred being, <laughs> and, and spins him a little bit. And then yeah. shoves him in Felsec's face and rubs yeah, her that's, cheek. Oh, that's awesome. Where'd you guys find this little bro? So the is short like story, story is that we're so good at this, me and Drask. We're so good at this. The long story is, and then the bomb conveys everything Drask and him did <laughs> yeah. last session. <laughs> Could you believe it? Wow. What are the odds? There's a Gana, like a Gana median, like here? Yes. And you guys didn't like kill it? I yes. mean, he's a real bummer. We're he was such a bummer, to kill him. I get it. I think him living is worse than him dying he in his honestly, own head, you know? Honestly, frankly, I don't want to bring any of you over there to kill him, because I think you just get bummed. <laughs> I mean, hey. I would be bummed if I was going to be killed, too, but... No, he was bummed before the getting killed. Uh. Huh. It's just, where is hmm. the fun in it if they're so bummed? Holy shit. Fun? I don't know. <laughs> Fair Anyways. by me, I guess. But hey, if we meet out. any other Ganymedians, their head's coming off, all right? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so where are you guys heading, actually, for, for these these boats? It, it, like, I think the bomb, know. at least, would be like, let's go to the commercial district because that's where you'd get a rental boat. Okay. Yeah. Probably. It's probably in the place where people yeah. are selling things. All right, just uh, feel free to move your characters to where you uh, would like to look for, to know more about the boat. Wait, hold on, hey. Hold on, I got tiny legs. Uh, the commercial hub, uh, the trade center, the warehouses, all of this area is just bustling. No matter what time of day, everyone seems to be working on trade with the other islands. So you just kind of see people moving with purpose all around here, uh, especially in this area. Uh, most of it is designated for uh, manufacturing. And you'll see a couple of commercial uh, ships that are available uh, specifically by the tourist center. But it's up to you who you'd like to ask. You can ask any of the warehouse people, uh, any of like the industrial uh, boat folk, or you can go over to the tur tourist center. Tourist center Ooh. seems like the smartest idea. Yes, that would be. But I stop the first person I see walking down the dock. I, I stop them with both hands and get in their way. Oh, uh, oh my get, God. <laughs> uh, they get back in your way. Uh, you're stopping an orc and he's looking straight at you. Hey. Watch it, bud. Where do I rent boat? <sighs> and he points over at the tourist center. Bye. <laughs> Bob's like standing at the door when he's <laughs> <laughs> like just looking at you. I found it. Then we got a he'll smart one on and hands. walk away. <laughs> Bye. All right. Yeah. Bob walks in. Welcome to my shop. You're gonna see Hello. Little, you're gonna see a little Kenku there, a little little lady Kenku with a big old bow in her hair. Welcome to the shop. How can I help you? We need a boat, a powerful vessel for which to sail to. Where are we going? Underwater uh, boat. Un do you also do underwater boat? Uh, scratches. Uh, she scratches her little nostril as she looks over. <laughs> huh? Underwater boat, like a submersible. 
Yes, one of those. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We don't do any commercial summer, uh, uh, commercial summer, uh, submersible tours here, if that's what you're looking for. Uh, our last sub, our, our last submersible got destroyed. We don't talk about it. <laughs> so it like looks down. You the KQ looks Why down. Why don't a you bit. talk about it? What happened to it? I don't know. Okay. Well, I don't want to do a submersible anymore. What is? Do you have <laughs> rentals for surfaceables? Ones that are on the surface of the water. Ah, I like that. Yeah, we do surf for surf for surfaceables. Yeah. Where Where is your destination? Uh, where are we going again? We're going to the southeast. West. South. West. <laughs> southwest. The volcano. The oh. volcano to the the nearest southwest volcano island. Oh, that sounds like. Padrona. Oh yeah, that Padrona. one. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, we're new here. No, I do. <laughs> I understand that as well. Where do you do? I'm from out of town. Where did you come from? Not here. Okay. Yes. <laughs> the KQ doesn't ask any further understanding what that means. <laughs> well, we do have several ways that you can go about doing it. We got some uh, official ones from the Ionian uh, Authority. Uh, those will probably be your cheapest bets. Uh, but if you're looking to travel incognito, well, we can provide something for you there as well, but that's going to be a little more uh, unofficial. What's the rate on the unofficial one? Oh, well, for that, I, I could go ahead and uh, point you to a couple people who's probably in the docks. They're going to ask you a little bit of money. Some of them will ask you for 300 credits a person all the way up to 500 credits if they really truly believe that you're a, you're a threat of some kind. Wait, guys, why do we need an unofficial one? Or... I don't know, I was just wondering, and also partially because... We I mean, I guess our, it would be untraceable. You know, it'd be a little bit easier, probably, for us. Can we, oh uh, just I want the biggest one. I think we should take the biggest one. Well, what? If, you, if you want the, one of the biggest ones, well, uh, like I said, we do have the official ones. If you're not trying to be uh, elusive with the authorities, I suppose. Uh, there we got one that allows for uh, a couple of three uh, three person rooms. That's a 50 credit uh, room. It's very nice. Very comfortable. I like the, uh, uh, perhaps that one. It's, that one. Perhaps Kelsey, it's Kelsey more. Kelsey raises her hand like she's on a tour. She like raises it. Oh, yes, yeah, so I can help you. Um, I have a question. Where did you get the submersible? The one that got destroyed? Where did I get it? Something we've had now for about uh, past 15, 20 years. Oh, okay. Um, follow-up Our- question. Yes. Are submersibles of a military variety more common to see than just, like, Blinks. privately owned? Links a little bit. A uh, military variety? How exactly would you define that? Like, um, like, could you get, like, not like get one, but like, could you see one at like a military base, perhaps? I might imagine so, yes. Assuming they weren't already submersed. Oh, yeah. I <laughs> guess I never <laughs> even thought about that. Yeah. There could be submersibles all around there us. There could be submersibles everywhere. I don't know. Right below us. What? I don't know. I stomp I'm... on the ground. <laughs> Probably. I don't see what the big deal is about going underwater. It's terrifying underneath there. Well, That's what, what I do. Like, like, need I want to go underwater. so bad. Oh, well, I mean, well, you can go over to the downtide floats. We've seen a couple of uh, luxury submersibles and private submersibles over there. Maybe someone might be interested in selling that for you. But that's where a, is that? I, I'm uncertain. Oh, it's uh, right over here. Yeah, kind of like points over in do 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 in this direction. Uh, but then mm-hmm. we'll sort of follow up and say, let me just get the camera back there. Beautiful. Um, but if you're really looking to purchase for uh, some sub- submissibles, then you're you're probably gonna want to go to over to uh, over to the city of Norway. Over in the Osmine region. And oh. that's going to be more west. Oh. West. Yeah, there's right. a couple of submersible vendors over there. Probably going to have mm. to pay a, a pretty credit, I'd imagine. Do you mind I mean, if that's we a good uh, start, I think? take a small huddle and be right back? Sure, sure, of course you. you don't mind. We're technically about to pay you, possibly. Hang on, we'll be right back. Uh-huh. <laughs> Bo does not... <laughs> 
get a part of this huddle. In fact, he very slowly walks up to the counter and he whispers, Hey, do you, uh, do you have a tiny boat? <laughs> we got boats of all sizes, sure. No, I mean tiny boat. You know what uh, I mean? Like, Wink's tiny. Oh, yeah, like a, like a, like a shard rowboat or something like that? Yeah, that could probably work. He, he takes out microwave and puts him on the counter. Tiny boat. It's just kind of squeaky walking around a little bit. Um, do you want a boat for your hedgehog, I guess? Yeah. I mean, you could probably make one out of like a block of wood or something. Oh, blinks. You should probably Oops. contain that somehow so it doesn't get killed or something. All right, you don't got any boats. Thank you for your time. But so turns around and gets back in the huddle. <laughs> Fellas? Yeah. What's Why do up? we not want to go no. underwater? I want to well, go underwater. I'm going to be honest. The main reason I don't want to go underwater is because I feel like we're still struggling with the part where we're in space sometimes, and I don't think we need to pick up any more weird and confusing dynamics to almost kill ourselves with. You know what I mean? I mean, it's probably just because rain's going to be underwater, right? That's the guy we're looking for. I mean, probably. No rain from the sky. Okay. That's that's like that's like funny, but like we are group huddling, so like a little yeah, bit. Yeah, let's try to keep the jokes to a minimum, okay? <laughs> what joke? Oh huh. Okay. I was just looking up at the sky. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, listen, here are our options that we can immediately do right now. Option one, we get a boat and we take it southwest to our current uh -huh. destination. <laughs> or option two, as far as I'm concerned, is we head on up north towards downtide floats and we help ourselves to a submersible. Oh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now, one of those is definitely going to be more difficult, but uh -huh. possibly but much cut faster. Out like the middleman of exactly. having to rent two different vehicles. You sly dog. We just leave an IOU that says one submersible and then we'll bring it back later and then all will be forgiven. Well, yeah, if they're well, reasonable people. I think that's kind of the only thing to do because if we just wanted to go to another island, I could just fly us there. Well, not the volcano island. Remember, there's like electromagnetic like bullshit that'll fuck with the shard. It fucks with the shard. Sorry, yeah, really fucks with the, oh my god, are you listening to this? Are you serious? <laughs> it, are you serious? It's, it's, loud, ju it's just the five of you at my shop. <laughs> <laughs> I was closing you, up. Sorry, Promise don't you have you like appointments to schedule you or something? Your ears or something? <laughs> okay, I'll pretend to not listen. Listen, all I'm saying is I bet I can still hit that island. Are you saying? Are you saying we try to fly the no to the scary? No, I like that idea. Actually, it sounds a little kooky. A oh little fun. my god! I, I would so fun much fun rather steal Zug, a submersible. Zug, I deeply, deeply believe in you. However, m we are pretty much one one of two landings. We've kind of had one bad one and one pretty good one. And um, yeah. Statistically frankly, speaking. Yeah. And I always hit the ground. What's but the here's the thing. In the one or two landings we did good, there was no scary electromagnetic blast that was going to mess with anything. This time, there's also an additional real factor that's going to make it more dangerous. Yeah. That's okay. where I'm kind of nervous. I get it. Okay. Okay. Fellas... We gonna steal a submersible? I mean, borrow a submersible? We're going to borrow it and then definitely bring it back for sure. All right. Um. Well, hmm. uh, Let me think. Because well, mm -hmm. that. What if we just borrow one? Like, actually, like, say, hey, can I borrow this? That's what. I'm... Oh, we can lead yeah, with that. Yeah, I could. Yeah, yeah, I could. Yeah, yeah. Try that. Uh, you'll you'll hear the sound of a uh, pen, like a quill holder, like dropping on the floor. Oh my god! Sorry, what? I'm sorry. 
The Kenku we... hops over, picks it up, puts it back up, <laughs> continues on with their appointments. Huh. We gotta, like, I don't know, cast some spell on this lady so that she doesn't remember what we just talked about, maybe? Listen, we... No, 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 no. We just had a conversation with her. We know she plays yeah, fast she and loose us. with the law. She's cool. You, you sure about I that? Think. I don't know. I don't like the glint in her eye. I'm going to be I'm gonna level with all of you. There's nothing I can do to silence someone other than silence them for good. So I think we just kind of have to trust them on this. Ah. Huh. Yeah. You got nothing to worry about. <laughs> oh squid. You can trust old Whistler. <laughs> Is that your real name? Yes. Alright, <sighs> nice. As far as you're concerned. Hmm. Oh. Huh? Um, guys, yeah, I think I'm, tell I'm telling you guys, she's cool. Okay. I so tell it. me this: uh, why why are we not getting two boats? We get the one boat, we sail across, we have a good time, a little drinks, a little fishing, and then we come back, and then we get the other boat. I'm sorry, run that by me one more time. My ears are small. So that we only have to do one trip, Bo. We're okay, just gonna get the submersible, and then never it's come just back. Just that simple. And then someday will return it or not it depends on if anyone tries to get it back. what's a submersible I, this is news to me it's I'm called a understand. submersible in this universe Bo. ah this yes <laughs> but what i don't even know the words that just came out of my mouth okay yes that sounds like a great plan let's do that okay okay let's just find the first one we see and see if you know they left the keys in or something yes what? exactly Hey, I don't mind. Uh, I'm sorry to interrupt your clearly private thing. Uh, just, I thought you'd want to know, uh, just as a random tidbit, you know, a little thing of the area. Uh, but I'm pretty sure the uh, the harbor with all the submersibles closed around nine o'clock. Then you're gonna have to deal with security. Well, I told you guys. Told you she was cool. All right. Well, thanks for uh, thanks for the info, Whistler. Hey, thank you. Would you like to introduce yourself to me? Uh, Space no, here. no, I don't want to do that. She nods. I understand. Good luck out there. Don't get yourself killed or arrested. Oh, uh -huh. does that thing where he like does not unlock eyes and like walks backwards out the door, still staring at her until the door closes and you can see Bo on the other she side. She waves with her feathers. Glass. Yeah, she keeps okay. waving at you. Bye bye. So long. <laughs> I looks at everyone else to feel like to like get an idea of where everyone else is at it, and if they think this person's gonna snitch on us or something. <laughs> nah. <laughs> and that bird kicked ass. Mm. Mom looks at Zug, since he seems to not have a take on this yet. I Zug is just staring at the fucking shop clerk, like with the intention of, "Are you gonna be a problem?" <laughs> The bomb clocks that. Uh, he's going to walk up to the shop clerk. Hey, so listen here. Hmm? You didn't see us. If you, if I ever hear that any utterance of what happened in here ever comes out, I assure you of one thing. I am capable of incredibly powerful magic. And I will haunt you in your dreams until you die. I can and will. You will spend the rest of your life in a waking nightmare because whenever you fall asleep, you will be haunted by the worst of visions. You understand? Go ahead and roll an intimidation check for me, please. Uh, that is a 24. Oh, I literally, and sucked a backflip right behind me. Literally, <laughs> literally didn't. <laughs> you know what? I did. I did do it. <laughs> and, and then I had like a b-boy stance and like crossed my arms and I'm like, are you going to be prob? <laughs> Yo! Uh, so she's going to look at the bomb, kind of blink slowly a little bit, and it's kind of nodding along, and then as you continue on, the nodding kind of slows a little bit, and then it stops, and then she, she, she halts there, and then she'll look over at you and say, there's just not going to be a problem. I've been here for, for many years now. I understand what happens here at port, and I also understand... Not to really ask any questions of suspicious packages that may come back and forth or whatever they may be fighting for. So no, you have nothing to worry about. 
All right. Yeah. And if you got any problems with that, you just remember the name Jonathan Harbor. Let's get out of here, gang. Oh, who? I walk out. Nice to meet you, Jonathan Harbor. <laughs> she ro roll deception check. I just want to see if she <laughs> believes you. Please. Oh, yeah. Mother. <laughs> she rolls her eyes. And is like whatever you say, Jonathan yeah, Harbor. That's cool. I should come up with a code name. <laughs> Hey, There's like a boat guys. that says the Jonathan on it, and you huh? just kind of looked over here at like the European Harbor. Jonathan <laughs> uh, Harbor. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> We've got 15 minutes until the docks close, so. Well, um... I don't know, you guys want to get a little kooky, get a little drink before we do a little something crazy? Yo. We might not have time. Oh, we no, always we, have, we time. have time. We have time. We have the whole night. Yeah. There's Wait, no, always well, think... time. Don't be a sore loser. Let's go get something and party. Well, that's fine. But I think yeah, before yeah. it closes, we should find a, a one that we want while we're around, allowed to walk around freely. And then we come back and, and get it. So I don't uh... know how to tell you this, but we have seven minutes to walk over there. <laughs> Yeah. You want to use your ship? Get over there, look at one, then fly your ship back. <laughs> Mom just, just starts walking. <laughs> We're all just standing here. Okay, come on. <laughs> oh, oop, look at the time. Oh, oh, it's already closed. What I tell you? <laughs> oh, crazy! I'm feeling a little bit parched. I think. Is it closed? Did we make it? Uh, you will watch the. Uh, well, first of all, you, you're gonna head over here past the curiosity yep. store. Yup, that's what I'm counting on. <laughs> I have a plan. Uh, as you go over to the curiosity store, uh, the door is wide open. Ah. Oh. Hmm. What was your plan? Well, I was going to honestly just ask the guy who's been working here in both stores that surround this area if they've ever seen any security flaws in the uh, dock. <laughs> I don't know about this one, Chief. Like uh, the goblin he, you shoot off. Like the girl, the girl, uh, the the lady work in the tourist center. Like we know she plays fast and loose with the law, but this guy seems like a real rat, a narc to me. And never ran on you. He walks out of the oh empty store. Oh my god! What did I say? Oh boy! Ah, oh, jeez! Saw oh boy. Uh, hey, hey! So, uh, uh, what do you want? Listen. Okay. I want to ask you something important. Uh, okay. Have you seen the submersibles around here? Uh, I'll I'll tell you if you uh. You stay out of my head. I don't know what you did, but my head is pounding. You have my word that as long as you answer me, honestly, I will never do what it, What was it I, you think I did? Got in your head? Got in my head. I won't do that again to you, even though I don't know what you're talking about. I kept hearing in my head, find Kem, find Kem. It was like a nagging feeling in the back of my mind. Well... Oh, the like only thing I remember, hours. the only thing I remember was you getting hit in the head by quite a few knickknacks and curiosities. Yeah, I think that happened too. Anyways, you're looking for a submersible? Yeah, we're just wondering if there's any around here. Oh, uh, now that you mention that I have seen a few of them. Uh, two of them are, are military grade. I'm really uncertain what the European authorities doing. But then I saw this Himmel class submersible. It looks real nice. I mean, real nice. How nice. Like, <laughs> and he holds out two hands. Like, this is a measurement of niceness. Like, this nice. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> we don't really... The bomb's not like, that one. And, like, whisper. We don't really need a military-grade one, I don't think, right? That would get the 
eat on it. You said it was this nice. We gotta get well, that. That's yeah, well, I'm kind of with Doug on this one. I, I don't know. I kind of want the cooler one. Why, correct correct I go? me if I'm wrong. The Himmel one is not the military correct. grade one, right? Correct. Yeah. The Bob's saying he doesn't want to get the military grade ones because he's going to get a bunch of heat on it. The Himmel class submersible is very much like a, a personal submersible with you and your, your friends. It's, it's, a, it's definitely a luxury. Ah, and yes. In fact, uh, you can get yourself a Himmel class submersible. Typically, it's a lot of money. Um, usually has to be built, uh, there, but the black market does sell some, uh, for 10,000 credits. Yeah, we're not doing that. So anyways, uh, where's this one to steal? Yes, where's this? <laughs> so not that, just because we're just, we're just so curious. We're such big fans of submersibles. Uh, yeah, it's, over, it's over, it's over there at the, at the downtime floats. All right. Uh. And just because we're so curious about submersibles and also their safety and security measures, is there anything that uh, we should know about a Himmel-class submersible? Not that there's any reason we'd need to know, but just out of curiosity, because we're all such big fans here of submersibles. He stares past things. you for like a second before saying... How would I know? I run a curiosity <laughs> store. I don't know. I think a curiosity store person would be quite curious about many things. You think I have the money to go into a Himmel? No. Hmm. Okay, bye. Okay, goodbye. Forever this time. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I hope. Ah. Yeah, I hope so, you... too. Oh, are you nervous about this? No, why? It seemed like you really wanted to hit a bar before we go. I did, but no one seems to listen to this little dude in my ears, Twitch. I could use some, you know, a little bit of a uh, drink before we do some crazy stuff. We always seem to go on an empty stomach, and I don't know. I just want to... Okay, bye. <laughs> I fight shittier when I'm drunk. <laughs> oh well, frankly, oh. alcohol doesn't really do it for me. That's why I usually just make it for others. I don't know, and I never give any. Us, then? Well, hey guys. you never ask. Hey, Zug. Welcome hey back. Guys. Okay, well, I'm asking now. Well, then maybe I'll make you something when I have the time. Okay, well, you don't have time now, so I see... Oh, I think, uh, I don't know. I think this is our vacation, isn't isn't it? Hey, oh no, my we, god, we, wait, guys. Huh? We did come here for a vacation. Yeah, see, you guys always forget we do these crazy hijinks and we don't really party. And I'm looking to party. I got Michael Wave here in my pocket and he's going... Eek! So I think he's a little bit excited to do something crazy before we do something crazy. You know what Excuse I mean? Excuse me, don't power RP Michael Wave <gasps> like you were doing. Okay. Oh, oh, oh my I was God. saying what he sounded like. You know, I was that was not coming from him. You can be Michael oh, Wave, right? It's okay. Damn. Just, just, I'm just, um, just don't, <laughs> just don't do it again. Well, how about look. this? I want to go get like a like a nice IPA. Yeah. And then that we can hit, we could, we could party, right? Is there any beaches yeah. around here? Ooh, we're oh, surrounded yeah. by beaches, dude. Um, these are harbors and docks. Okay. <laughs> no, Zach's Does right, it beach need a sand? Yeah, yeah. yeah. we need I sand. Think, I think um, the other island had some. Points over to the one we can kind of see from here. <gasps> Ooh. We gotta do this crazy stuff now, or can we like beach it? I don't know. We vote. We, I mean, hmm? what if we just do this in the morning? Yeah, I don't think we're on a time crunch, right? Ooh, well, I, I mean, like it was what, simply that saying? if we're if we're planning on stealing it, dude, I was gonna slam an IPA be and steal a submersible. I don't know what's going on. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm. You know, I'm. A, Unless I'm we want to try to do the uh, talking well, technique. So want like a little, uh, well, like a little cocktail with like an umbrella in it, Bo. <laughs> Oh, you speak my language, Velsic. I think that's what I want, yes. Bomb, I think we yes. should do the talking technique. You're good if at you it. If you want to do the talking technique, I can probably do the talking technique. You want to? Okay. <laughs> Crazy idea, all right? But I'm a, I'm feeling like a bit of a rambunctious guy. Uh -huh. What if we go back to Stingray Island and we have a beach barbecue bonfire with Ooh. the lady we left in our ship and the lady on the island. Ah, yes. Well, I'm fine with that if we want to go with the talking option. I just didn't know if we want to do the just walk in and steal it option or not. That's what I figured we were going for. I'm fine I with can, either. 
Yeah, both swim uh, there? me too. It's close enough? Right. Oh, are you swim? No, you need a boat to cross over there. I think we <sighs> crossed right here before. Yeah, uh, so right. there would there would be a small uh, boat over there. Yeah, I think we can just take that. That back. you left. Yep. And it would take about another hour to to row back over to Stingray Island. Is that what you guys would like to do? Yeah. I look directly I... at Felsic when I say, "Let's do this." Oh, okay, sure. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Woo! An hour passes. All right. It is currently 10 in the evening. Is there is there like sandy beaches on this island? Uh, mm, uh I would say kind of yes, but not, the, but not the sand like you're used to like beaches. It's it's just like it's just a dirt, you know what I mean? It's just it's just hardened dirt over in Stingray hmm. Island. Okay. It's good for it's good for like if you're doing some camping, you're doing little 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 lakeside slash, you know, little barbecue style over there. But it definitely wouldn't be considered a beach. OK, well, let me do what we got. Zug is going to like get off of the boat uh, after arriving back and just start trying to make the biggest bonfire he can. Like, Whoa. I'm getting every scrap of wood, any anything flammable and just uh -huh. thrown into a pile. Uh, Verso's gonna walk out. She's gonna be like, oh, "Like, so what are you doing over here?" Uh, we're like having a barbecue, you know. Barbecue bonfire. I yeah, you're a piece of wood like on. welcome to join us. Oh uh, well, I got some. Business. Actually, you're invited. <laughs> um, actually, I'm formally inviting you. Well, that's uh, that's mighty kind of you. Um, I got some 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 stuff that I still need to do though. That well, stuff can wait a night. Come on. We had stuff we were going to do, but we're going to party instead. Well, <laughs> she's just kind of, all right, you got me. So what's the occasion? Did we need one? Vacation. We're on vacation. Vacation. Oh. You know, a little bit of kickback. Wait, you're on. What, what, what do you mean by vacation? Oh, uh, we're multitasking. Yes. <laughs> It's a work having a little fun. vacation. So we're here, having a little fun before we have to do some very like not fun things. So like, you're uh, you're, in a you're couple hours. So you came here to Stingray Island to do to vacate a little bit? No. Yes. Wait. Wait. Maybe. Stop, Bob. Stop. <laughs> I mean, this ain't exactly a tourist destination. If you whatever, if you get drunk enough, anything could be a beach. Uh, hold on one second. Let me see what I got for you. She'll go in her house. Whoa. Okay. Okay, sorry. I'm just like really afraid of cartel people. Don't worry, it's fine. Hey, I think. she probably. Okay, sorry. The actual reason I want to get her like I don't know, hang out with us a little bit, a little friendly, is she probably knows a thing or two about, like you know, submersibles and the security surrounding them. What if we mm. like take? What mm. if we try to take one? And then it like an alarm goes off, you know, and it like it, like a like a ship alarm. <clears throat> it felt sick. Do we even know how to hotwire a submersible? We What's don't even think? know how to drive one to my knowledge. All right, I'm back. I'll figure it out. Do you Hi. ever heard of the term fell sick where you don't talk work when you're vacationing? I'm sorry. Okay. You ever heard about that? <laughs> she starts Excuse peeling me. wood. Hello? She's just handed everyone a small. Peel, she peels the oh, ground. Thank you. A small <laughs> little <laughs> cup. Thank you so much. And then she'll mm. she'll uh, open this. It's not this inside, sweetie. Uh, she'll open <laughs> up this bottle, and you will will smell the 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 best I could describe is like turpentine. Like it hits the nostrils immediately. <laughs> and this is like, all right, let's begin vacationing. And then she'll oh. uh, start filling up your cups mm. with this the, liquid. The bomb is going to hand his cup to Bo, who he you knows likes this. alcohol so much. <laughs> yeah, you love and he doesn't this drink shit, alcohol because yeah. it doesn't do anything to him. So he's like, here, Bo, double for you. Yeah, weren't you the one slamming like three, four, five, like uh, like margaritas mm. at the bounty yeah, place? Uh -huh. Yeah, but this one doesn't have an umbrella. It's a little different. Hey, hey. Oh, Here you uh, go. Oh, you the bomb. Any umbrellas? Minor Jeez. illusions. An umbrella into both of the cups. <laughs> Didn't realize you were so oh. Okay. Hey. Well, hello. 
Oh, I came and... back with some. Oh, you found some umbrellas. Well, that's pretty, that's pretty awesome. Anyways, uh, she'll pour a little glass to herself and raises her cup. Uh, to um, new friendships. Mm. Yeah. Cheers. Mm. Cheers. Chillins. To chillins. Cheers. Uh, uh, Brett, does uh, microwave say something in this moment? Uh, microwave is currently sleeping in your fucking pocket. He had a big day. Oh, baby boy. Had a big old day. Bro. Bro. But I'd like an estimation of how large I've gotten this pile of bonfire materials. Uh, sure. Go ahead and give me a uh, strength check. Strength check? Yeah, see how much you've gathered over this time. I'm not very strong. Or you've been panting a little bit, like, oh. Does my brother need help? Drask, help me. It felt like I bet I could get more than you. I didn't get a 19. Though. Oh, yeah. You got you got, you got a Whoa. pretty big. During this entire thing, you got a big old bonfire pile. And the entire time, she's like, kind of like, every time you go to grab something, she kind of moves it off a little bit to like a drier part of the land. You're like, yeah, no, right over there. Right over there. Right over there. It's kind of surround out a bit. Yeah, right there. That's good. That's good. That's mm. cool. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, you got a big old, uh, you got a big old bonfire pyre, pyre, uh, bleh, pyre here. It'll probably treat you well. All right. Once I've got a good chunk of it assembled, uh, and, and it's basically ready to go, I'm going to gather everybody up and like <laughs> huddle up quite a, a little bit of a distance away. And then, you know, just look to the group. All right, you ready? Yeah. yeah. I spark on my gauntlet. Little flame is pointing out. I just aim it at the bonfire and I shoot out a little little fire bolt. Oh, uh, yeah. Wow. Uh, that shit ignites immediately. Is it quite flammable? Oh, yeah. Maybe you got some of the driest pieces around. You figured out exactly <laughs> what you're looking for and it just kind of it just immediately lights up. All right, you want to see something really cool? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, once this thing is roaring and, and, and you know, cooking off quite well on its own. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to. Whoa. <laughs> this might Whoa. be a mistake. <laughs> oh, <laughs> do go do on. <laughs> Ooh. I'm going to cast a 15 foot high. One foot uh, by five foot. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Wind wall on top of it. <laughs> Sen sending the flames Why? into like a gigantic fucking tornado. Spiral. <laughs> into the Whoa. Huh. So it's just a, a, like a pillar of flame straight up 15 feet. Okay. Let's see what this does. I'm a little Oppenheimer, dude. I could do more. <laughs> do we want to add even more? Yep. <laughs> yeah, yeah I think so. It's vacation. What well, you know, going a little kooky. Bo's done with the first drink. <laughs> Are we sure oh, we want me to do more? He's just like blowing up into the air. Uh, and she's like, oh, I don't know about all that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, I don't know about that, sir. Woo! And then I and then I drop it. That was cool. Yeah, you kind of see this huge, like oh. fiery tornado, and then you, you're dropping it immediately, like it just kind of like goes back into the fillet lane. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> just wanted to make the fire go high. The bomb clocking that we're done decides not to cast flame strike on the. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll save so, that for another day. Uh, how long have you been living on Europa? Mm, huh? She's, the thing. she's she's looking over at you, huh? Wait, you talking to me? Yeah. I've been How living long here. How you been living on Europa? Uh, Were you been... born here, or did you like move here from Io or something? No, uh, I, I I came from Io. Oh yeah, me too. Yeah, I used to be uh, alabaster myself. Yo, yeah. I mean, I don't know if you clocked it, but like, same. Uh, a little bit. I caught a, I caught a little Clocked bit of it. Clocked it a little bit. Just yeah, a, I get that a lot. Just a, <laughs> just a smidgen. Just a, just a smidgen. Um, hey, sweetheart, I got a question for you. What? Oh, you, me? Yeah, absolutely. I want to make okay. sure that you're doing, you're doing hunky dory and 
you know, and everything's doing all right for you. Um, and she looks over at you. What is this? What do you mean, what's what? Are you, uh, I don't know. You just, you, you just feel like you're a little, uh, like you got something in the back of your mind. Something weighing on you. <laughs> she squints. <laughs> she squints at her. <laughs> I mean, are Ever you... been in a submersible before? <laughs> <laughs> yes, we're all dying to know. <laughs> Bo down to second drink. Uh, can I get a constitution saving throw from Bo? Yeah, I'm like, this is going to take me a second contest. I'll do this every time. Is he tilting? No, that's why I try to spell it. I try to be on the constitution. Where, where, where's it under? He's save. mumbling in his drunken <laughs> stupor. Uh, oh, if you mouse they over, are fucked. If you mouse uh, over attributes, uh, click mm. constitution, and it'll ask you if you want to make an ability check or a saving throw. Oh, wait, wait, sorry, saving throw? Sorry. I'm saving throw. Got it. Whoa! Oh, the iron stomach grails. Party Whoa. animal. Yeah. I love to party. Yeah. All right, continue. Oh, why do you want to know about a submersible? Um, it's relevant to the bounty that we're trying to collect while we're on Europa. Oh, okay. Uh, How do you start a submersible? Is there a way to start a submersible without some kind of owner's key? Uh, well, let me go ahead and see. Okay. <laughs> well, you just, you happen to be in luck. Uh, recently did a job with a submersible or three. Uh, the tricky thing about it is trying to break into the system itself. Normally you'd have a key of some kind on your person. May even be encoded on the individual, but that's okay. Cause anything can be hacked if you know what I'm saying. But some of no these kidding. submersibles, you know, people buy very high-end security systems, and they do work, but anything. You'd need a really high-end hacker, is what you're saying. Well, anything in time can be broken mm. into. Interesting. Um, another thing. Have you heard about submersibles disappearing or being destroyed recently? Oh, dear. Yeah, there's, uh... You get a couple of fishermen's tales. You get a couple of uh, little little spooky stories about submersibles leaving the dock and never coming back. I haven't heard anything that's factual, however, um, but I wouldn't be surprised. Uh, you see, they're building a lot of stuff not only above the water, but underwater as well. Many of the corporations, they're hoping to mine the core of Europa to bring a, a new bounty, a, a new source of wealth. However, because this planet once upon a time used to be frozen, there are a lot of things that are awake now. Things that are not of our time. Possibly things that would easily consume a submersible. Ah. Uh. Cool. Um, <laughs> but but if you're asking me, do I know what those things are? Absolutely not. In fact, nobody does. Yeah, I mean, it could just be, uh, you know, like malfunctions or whatever. Right. Um, yes. Yeah. Or it could oh, be, yeah. it, or kind it could of. be something that's so terrifying that anything that encounters it never returns. Or it could be something that's not terrifying. As it in, could be like, a normal, giant, like, can be explained silly by looking creature. Means. Wait, what? What are you talking? <laughs> she looks over at the box. What? Well, oh. if it's not terrifying, if it's something funny looking like, a, I don't know, like a big seagull, that's not very scary. Big clown. Big like clown. clown. If, are you like a horse? Have you ever seen a horse? Are you, are you... <laughs> <laughs> so, 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 Like this, but oh, big oh, wouldn't be very scary is... to me. Boy, what's wrong with you? Oh, it's takes the drink. I'm gonna have a hard time forgetting that. Uh, Zug takes off all his clothing. What? what? I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I got. I'm. Both At last, we're finally <laughs> letting loose. Are we swimming? <laughs> starts taking off his clothes. <laughs> Zug takes oh, everything no! off. Zug takes what? everything off hey. except his boxers and his. Wait, no, 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 no,
Really Can I have another nervous. drink, lady? This is gonna be a long night. Yeah, here you go. Pour Thank a little you. in your glass. Zug is walking into the darkness towards the water. It's swimming time. Where are you? Uh, Someone where are you... explain swimming to me. Where are you going? You just, the here, water. dude, you uh, you go, go up to the water and then you, you Wait, just, no, um, don't. Wait. you literally jump. You cannot slowly go in. You go from point A to point B, hey, zero to ten, he, like, and you get in. Yeah, what if Bomb just like becomes the ocean? We're all watching him. He's got everyone looking. It's cool. Now jump in. Well, I'm gonna like, put, I'm gonna poke my little hand in first and make sure I don't dissolve because now Drask's got me all scared. You'll be fine. Bomb pokes his little uh, his little hand in to the water. Okay. Uh, so you're gonna like place your little like a little toe like a little handsy little finger or toesy in the he water. He makes a realistic finger and then does it. Oh, oh my okay, gosh. Okay. We do a quick roll real quick. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, so as you're putting your hand in you kind of feel um, your finger almost re- like reacting a little bit to the water um, as the salt of the sea is kind of like sizzling away of your genetic makeup. Oh. It is oh. It doesn't like tear apart your finger or anything like that, but it definitely feels like it. It, it, it kind of feels like you're in this like it. It, it almost feels like the area is starting to feel a little carbonated, like you're feeling the bubbles around your your finger. Oh, oh. Like, that's kind of cool. Well, that Jeez. was fun, and swimming is good. And then the bomb puts all his clothes. Back. <laughs> <laughs> like is, uh, but ankle, that's just enough for me. Ankle deep at the shore right now. It is freezing cold. It is uh, you like you're <laughs> ankle deep, and it is ice cold. Oh my god! Oh, that'll Wait. wake you. That'll wake you up. I... What is that? Wait, do, Justin, come here. Do not fuck with me. Justin, not even for a fucking second. I'm gonna make an insight check. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I trust him. Who <laughs> <never lie. laughs> oh, drinks the rest of his drink? No, Justin, you're, you're, come here. Look at this. No, no, you're making some shit up. What? She stands look, right, like right there. There's a little glint. It's nothing bad. There's just a little glint right there in the water. Look, if you. No, you there's get, a fuck. There are fucking things in there, Zog. They eat. No, you come here. Look, right. You gotta kind of bend down to see it. You see it? Whoa, wait. I think they're. I splash her in the face with water. <laughs> Yeah, uh, gotcha. <laughs> then I kick a little more water and run around. <laughs> Bo takes out his uh, paper and crayons. What is what is Felsic doing at that point? Like, what she is... just kind of she just kind of stiffened up like a cat. Just standing there, and Zug's she just, like, yeah, she just she just. And meanwhile, Zug's just like, yay! Like running yeah. around you, like you two this are like so splashing cool. each what? other. Why would and, anyone do this? This is you, so cold. And you're just standing there, <laughs> just nothing on your face. And then after you know, running around a little bit, Zug comes over and puts an arm around her. Oh, oh okay. Sorry for splashing you. It's cool. It was fucking cold, dude. Who does this? <laughs> Me. <laughs> okay. You want to splash me back? Not really. It's cold. Okay, I'll do it. I dive in full body. Constitution safe, please. Uh-huh. Never comes back up. <laughs> it's fucking eaten. <laughs> okay. So as you dive in, you're kind of underwater. You're enjoying it. You're splashing the cold water. It feels great. Um, Your body just starts to get cold yeah and, and, as as soon as i dive in i pop back out and shake my hair around and and start like oh my god oh. It. and i start running back to shore and get back to the bonfire yeah no more that macho shit dude don't get out of there <laughs> yeah he's just running back yeah so your green is kind of turning into a faint blue and you're just watching as like uh verso over here is looking at you and says, boy, what are you doing? Did you also feel the that burning? so cold. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I'm like warm up by the fire. Water it, is scary. Did you miss the part where I said this used to be a frozen planet? Well, I mean, I, I felt it was cold, but I did splash Felsic, so it was only oh. fair. <laughs> oh, um, 
When, how, when did it start like melting like this? Did we do that? Like, I mean, not obviously not us, but I mean, <laughs> no, like, I know, I know what you mean. Ah, uh, yes, the, the, <laughs> the great fire, I like, like, like <laughs> civilization. Right, right, right. <laughs> well, uh, I guess it kind of happened, from my understanding, when Io was shattered over a, a thousand years ago. I'm not entirely certain. I kind of threw a bunch of things in orbit. But uh, this moon in particular started rotating just a, a little closer over to the hellscape. And since then, it began to thaw out the, the ice pretty quickly, even though it was already slowly starting to break apart. It seems when the shattering happened, it's, things started moving uh, fairly fast. And over the past uh, few hundred years, uh, well... And this is what you see. A lot of people decided they wanted to start exploring the moon, building, man, you know, manufacturing islands such as this, a new opportunity of land and exploration. It's supposed to be some sort of rich person's paradise. I don't see it personally. I think the moon should belong to anyone. And anyways, I'm rambling. Uh, in short, uh, kinda, I suppose. Ah. Uh. But now that things are, like I said, on thawed, we really don't know too much of what's underneath there. It could be anything like a giant horse. Big clown. Big could, clown. Could big clown seahorse. That's a, yeah, that, that's your, your friend's got a point there. Could a be big clown sea. That would be all three of those things would be scary. I hey, uh, can't deny know. it. I'm just wondering, you know, this is supposed to be vacation, it's supposed to be cozy. You, you guys got any ideas to make the water warmer so we can enjoy going in it? I have one. The bomb starts getting ready to blast another spell into the water. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that might be a good idea. Last actually. chance to you stop me. A... <laughs> nope. I don't think it'll help. I just want warm water. I want to go inside. I want to get my fur wet. But uh, after seeing Zug, I uh, don't know if I want to do that. Sweet, sweetie, sweetie, sweetie. Uh, you're going to have a hard time trying to warm up this water. You might have to You might have to go to one of the few <sighs> hot springs that are oh. probably around. What? Well, I mean, we do have a lot of active volcanoes on the planet. And occasionally, somewhere nearby is a bit of, a, bit of the old bubbly water. That's where hmm. you're going to get a nice, nice heat source. Ooh, you want to point me in the direction? Oh, I mean, uh, oh, geez. I, uh, I do know of one volcano that is nearby. Now, what was yeah. that region called? I think it was called Todrona. Oh, <laughs> ah, yes. Ah, yes. <laughs> I hey, think Dave we Dave will Mo. go there then. <laughs> I think idea. that's a good idea. God yeah. damn it. <laughs> and we, oh, if we hadn't done this, we'd already be halfway there. <laughs> oh, of course, yeah. Of course, All there right, are let's, let's a bunch of other, the, of course, there are a bunch of other uh, volcanic islands around that you can also look for. But typically, you're going to want to look for that when you're looking for warm water sources. Otherwise, a lot of this stuff is too cold, I'm afraid. Yeah, this sucks. Oh, lays down. Yeah, sorry my home sucks. Really uh, apologize about that. If there's anything I no. can do to uh, make your time here a little better, she says as she's looking straight at Bo. Anything at all, no. you just let me know. I'm at your service. Listen, lady, it's the water that sucks. You're great. Don't worry about it. it continues to lay down. <sighs> that water was so cold, it was making my tusks chatter. Uh, I'm actually feeling <laughs> pretty warmed up. Do you guys want to go to the docks? What? Uh, absolutely, yes. Huh. Oh. Huh? What? You know. What? I thought we were just going to sleep here. Yeah, I'd want, I don't I'm, know. I'm, I'm both on board to do the talking plan and also do the let's just get this over with and be like a little silly plan. So yeah, really, I I mean, I'm on. I'm on whichever team the most people are on. I'm really willing to just keep flip flopping until we get there. Takes another drink of the 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 the, the drink. Takes another sip of the drink. <laughs> Why not just wait? You know, let, let's just rest up. Nah, I think we go. Huh. Hmm. That sounds like the 
tiebreaker has to be Drask. I'm so fucking confused. I thought we were, but now we're... Huh? What? Just say the number two. Which one? Which way, Drask? Come on, Drask. I know you're on my side here. I'm just gonna Brother, go back into my house. Do not betray me. <laughs> okay, good night. <laughs> I'll do what Zug wants. Yeah, oh my so. goodness! Wait oh, a geez. minute. Oh, that means that, oh, that, does that mean that I'm the tiebreaker again? Yes. <laughs> oh shit! Oh no. Um. Mido. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, uh, it's cool. Mido. It's cool. I just thought it might be a good window. Mido, pick do. the. You no, you two stand on that side, and you what? two stand on stand over there, and I'm, we'll I'm have Mido just choose based off of which one of the two of you Mido prefers. Uh, can you roll for the one hundred for me as well? Because that might actually influence this decision. <laughs> oh yes. No way. You, 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 you or the one hundred. All right. Uh, ooh, seventy-seven, <laughs> ninety-eight, thirty-five, and twenty-five. Mato. There we go. Uh, so uh, let's see. We got for 77. We've got <laughs> rat. Uh, so, okay. uh, Mido's a rat. It's just a, he's a little tiny wow. little rat. Wow. <laughs> that's, wow. that's, that's that. Uh, he does have it where uh, if his radiation blast successfully deals damage, Hunter Mark is cast. Uh, hmm. Let's see. I can't, I can't believe there was a rat. Like, yeah, you're a rat. Uh, he's <laughs> also a sentry. So as an action, can transform into sentry form. Is considered restrained. Mido Buddy cannot take any action during this turn except to revert from sentry form at the end of the round. My just Buddy casts a radiant blast at a target of your choice. So it's, it turns into a little turret. Like a little, little, okay. little boy. turret boy. And then telescope. So he's got a big ol' eye. Uh, you can look you oh, fuck, this is so cursed. Oh, we haven't had any of these. As an action, you can look through mitosis buddy's eyes. <laughs> Good. Okay. When looking through mitosis buddy, you have advantage on wisdom perception checks that rely on sight. So you're telling me we got a little rat mito yep. that can just kind of sneak and creep around like it's nothing. Yep. That I can see through. Yes. That's Whoa. kind of incredible. Yeah. Okay, wow. Um, that seems well, it's really too bad convenient, that now huh, instead guys? of picking, the bomb is going to allow Mido to pick by simply choosing which of these two groups they like more. Go on now, Mido. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no enticing him. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you have to let them choose of their own volition. Should we just like, should we look at it or should we look in a different direction? No, you can look at it. Just don't, okay. just don't make sounds at them. Zug locks eyes with No, Mido, you can't pick me. You have to pick one of those. <laughs> <laughs> Zug locks eyes with Mido Buddy and just starts doing a really slow, exaggerated, wavy dance, trying to mimic the actions of a blob. That's... Huh. That's weird. That's... I don't know no, what Mido, you <laughs> cannot pick me. You must pick one of them. Hmm. Um... Mido needs uh, persuasion checks from everyone involved. Okay. Can I do m mine as a performance check? I'll allow it. Can I do none because I'm not trying to entice him at all? <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> hey. oh yeah, God. yeah, you know what's good, little dude, right? <laughs> well, that figures that out. Mido Buddy will actually hop onto uh, Fel Six hair and turn into a little hairpin with a Mido Whoa. eye popping out of it. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Ew. That's actually awesome. Did you ill that? What the hell? You gotta get slimy hair now. <laughs> Slime hair. I'll just wash it. <laughs> uh, okay. I start get your shake, fucking, get your weapons. I start dumping like Start on the bonfire, or whatever. Just put it out. <laughs> you start dumping. The bonfire is not going out because of how big you guys fucking <laughs> made it. You're like, uh -oh. I'm just throwing like <laughs> palmfuls of dirt at it haphazardly. <laughs> like, well, the bonfire's not going out. I guess we can't leave. Oh, hey, I can. Doug. I can get rid of the bonfire. Oh. It, uh, okay. Wait, no. That would probably just make it worse. Never mind. 
<laughs> hey, Zug, can you do that thing where you cast the, you know, make things real on the fire? I come just a little curious. Make um, things real? I don't make things for you. You know where they give a little person, you know, like Toofy? Do you remember that when we that go, happened? Oh, that's because they gotta be small, like Toofy. Oh, okay, never mind. Put it out. I want it dead. I throw another handful of dirt at him. <laughs> hey, Mido, do you want to steal? Uh, the sand. Dodd not for yes or no. The, wi the wind of the sand kind of picks up, so as you toss it, it just blows back in your face. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what were you asking, Felsic? You want to steal, Mido? Not for yes or no. Uh, Mido Buddy doesn't move. Uh, Mido Buddy blinks a little bit, hops Mido off. Mido Buddy has no idea what's going on, okay? <laughs> what did you say to Mido to scare them so much? I didn't! I wasn't you trying to him. scare them! They scampered I off of we you were, so quickly. I thought we were cool. Aww. <laughs> hey, there, there, Mido. It's okay. Here, climb onto my hat. Uh, Mido Buddy <laughs> turns into a little beret uh, with a little eye popping out of it, but this time on your hat. Very good. Well, well, I'm throw another dirt pool at the fucking bonfire. Wait, It'll go it. out on its own. Will it? It might catch fire. Oh, no, things it, right? light on fire. I've burned oh, out so the many bomb, places in the this scrapyard. Is, the bomb doesn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> so, he I, just, fire I, just like, I just like how this conversation is happening, and then Mido, but, and then you just see another small pile of dirt being thrown on the bonfire. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, Did Bo so just get the ice storm yeah, so uh, a blizzard, a flash blizzard appears <laughs> oh and God. begins pounding away on the land, uh, and you all feel it. You all get Ow, real fuck. fucking God, gold. I, Ow, yeah, I let's get out of here. I think. Wow, I think we should leave. Uh, let's. I need deck saving throws from uh, Bo, Felsic, Zug, and Dras. <laughs> Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> awesome. You all Such take... Uh, oh, also, uh, uh, Drask. Is it deck save? Yes, please. Okay. Um, where was saves in the new menu? Uh, under attributes. Oh, yeah. Uh, attributes. Dex. You just click dexterity and it'll ask if you want to do a check oh, or a save. Oh, a delayed check saving throw. That's so cool. Awesome. Uh, Drask takes no damage. Everyone else takes... 24 points of damage. And the fire's out. Wait, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> and the fire's out, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, let's go. Um, we got things to he do takes today. half damage on the save. Jesus fucking Christ. Bro. Explain yourself. Explain yourself. He takes half damage on the save. Why? The creature takes 2d8 bludgeoning or 46 cold on a failed save or half as much damage on a successful one. But you didn't succeed. Drask did. Yes, Drask takes nothing. No, he takes half. Is what he's trying to say. He no, he, he has he has evasion. Right? Oh. Hey, rogue stuff. Rogue stuff. Cool. Evasive. Okay, yeah, he's so got evasion. Can I get your brother hurt? Zug? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Holy shit! Yeah. Yes, yeah. No. Uh, Drask has evasion, so uh, he takes half on success on on successes. Oh, sorry. Uh, on failures, he takes half damage. On success, he takes none. That was so cool the way you dodged all those icicles, man. I dodged them. I bet you I could dodge every raindrop if it was raining right now. I go for an unarmed strike. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. What have I dodge done? This. <laughs> I oh, don't wait. Dodge uh, it. I apologize. I, I keep forgetting you're half and half. You don't have evasion, do you? Um... Evasion is seven. Rogue. What am I in? Rogue? LOL. Can I uh, see LOL. my split? LOL. LOL. Uh, yeah, you're a little forward, oh, rogue, which means oh, you Jesus. are you are going to take twelve points of damage. And oh. as you punch me, you realize there's ice sticking out of me <laughs> as well. <laughs> oh, wait. You did if anyone wants <laughs> some, let's go. Medical attention. I can heal you. I'm for good. Your horrible pain. I'm actually good to go. Yeah, let's get out of here. Let's get it. Woo! <laughs> Another hour passes. It's now 11.43 at night. Uh, and we're doing a fucking heist. Let's go. You arrive over at the gate. 
Uh, so as you kind of like enter over here, the curiosity store doors are, excuse me, completely locked. And you'll see this sort of like gated area that is sealed. Uh, you'll watch as a couple of uh, security guards seem to be uh, pathing around here. Uh, how are you going to break through the uh, the gated area? What if I say in character, <clears throat> what if we just took the boat to the other boat and avoided all the security here. That was not a bad idea. Oh, wait, hang on. Like it's on this the way, thing. you know? Whoa. Oh. All right. So I you're. Guess. <laughs> so you want to take the uh, the boat around like this, around the other way to the submersible? Yeah. All right. Maybe. <laughs> I will need. A stealth check, uh, depending on who is piloting the boat, to see if they can try and keep out of the uh, the guards' views. Because you, you know they've got little flashlights, they got little spotlights, they're kind of looking around a little bit. So see if you can figure out a way to like stay within the cover of darkness. Yeah. Is it a rowboat, like manual? Uh, yeah, it's like a little rowboat. Like, uh, okay. yeah. In that case, I think Drask would be doing it because he is strong, and I would make him row because he's my brother. I'm a good rower. True. I mean... Hmm. Jim and Burl shit at stealth, huh? I mean, I have proficiency in stealth. Do you? I took it pretty recently, yeah. You'd, you'd want someone that's kind of leading the charge to kind of, like, make sure that they under that they can keep undercover, you know... Yeah, like, I just okay. didn't want to, like, metagame super hard, but I have proficiency in stealth now, so I can I can row. Uh... Yeah. Is the is it visually I could tell it's protected and if I go in like a spotlight, I'm fucked. Oh, like, I mean, can you yeah, see spotlights so, scouring the place? Yeah, so are you spending some time like kind of like looking yeah, at I would what's actually spend happening? time outside of it and once Understood. I realize that I would go Yeah, so uh, you, I don't you know would, how to get in there. Yeah, you would see you would kind of see it like patrolling a little bit. Um a couple of the guards are like patrolling around. Um and then on occasion you'll kind of watch them as they'll take some of the spotlights over the water as well just to make sure there isn't anything any funny business going on that doesn't seem to happen too often you feel like maybe you know they're, they're kind of like pacing a little bit uh after spending a little bit of time no one's really on like super high alert uh so it's just all about timing and just making sure that you're getting the, the row just right uh before they look out into the ocean if this is if, if this is the plan that you would like to do hey they're a thousand percent gonna see me <laughs> I, I don't want to row. I can try to take it. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, so, if a roll is, if a stealth roll is being made, I will assume it is because you guys are trying to row your way over to the submersible. Yes, I would oh. like to. What? Uh, I want to add since we've been doing like RP this whole time, so I haven't had to like give it out. I am going to do um. Uh, inspirational speech to Felsic, uh, hmm. Zug, and Drask. Understood. Inspiration has been granted. Huh. Hey, I, I feel, feel like better about right this now. whole thing. Yeah, you really inspire me. Oh, wait, I can give four now. I give one to Bo as well. Whoa, I don't want it anymore. Microwave. That's gross. I would love how was the last person thought of it. Oh. <laughs> give it to Michael. Wave. Go ahead. Yeah, I'm actually going to pop my inspiration he right now me. to do a stealth check with advantage. All right, be sure to shift click, please. Oh. Oh, oh my yeah. god. Oh, oh, oh my god, dude. I'm oh. prowling. Yeah, so you, so with the combination of your barbarian strength, uh, as well as your wonderful wonderful alabastarian eyes, uh, you will row under the cover of darkness until you will arrive kind of at the side of this small, as far as vehicles go, this sort of small looking submersible uh there you kind of see it'll have like streaks a little bit like it's some sort of like hot rod fucking submersible um and yeah you'll kind of like look around it, it looks like a big old sealed tube um you're trying to find where the entrance may be but you're unfamiliar with this model i will require an investigation check now here's where the fun begins now that you've arrived over at the submersible, uh, every failed check uh, means you're spending more time like looking around this. The more time you spend at this location, the higher the chance that a guard will spot you uh, as it continues its patrol around. 
So that is where you are at currently. But Can anyone investigate? It's going to have to be someone. Right. Well, was, uh, was, uh, you guys are saying, not going to make me investigate. No, 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 no. I was asking, can anyone or is it felt right now? Oh, anyone can. You guys are okay. by the boat right would, now. Yeah. Then I would like to. Okay. Yeah, please. Okay. Mm. So kind of as you're like looking around, trying to, to figure it out, you would actually notice a small latch over to the side. Um, this... Uh, specifically uh, on the dock itself. I mean, clearly the, how someone had to get onto the dock, they would have to have taken the the hatch, the door where they would have crawled off of and, and gone to the dock. Uh, so you would spot that kind of on the dock itself. Uh, you believe you'd be able to maneuver the rowboat just underneath the dock, uh, get over to that door. Uh, if you'd like to go ahead and make a perception check just to kind of see where the guards are, if you'd like to make any sort of plans or not, you're free to do that as well. Uh, but just keep in mind, any rolls you make just takes more time. But you do know the location of the door opening now. Uh, Zug does a bunch of, he doesn't say anything, but he does a bunch of nonsense hand symbols trying to communicate that the hatch is over there and that's where Got I it. go. <laughs> I just like start waving hands and doing like squiggly fingers and then He pointing. wants me to take out the guard. <laughs> <laughs> and then I start doing an X motion, X motion. Kill we could him. take it, we could take him out, we could take the guard out from here. Shakes his head no, tries to brush oh, it to the side. No. Waves his hand in front of his face, points to you, points to him, points to Hatch. Oh, okay. Hey, we're both talking. Can you just also talk? He doesn't talk. <laughs> All right. I'm this not dude going okay? First. What's happening? I, I do know. not understand. Not I need, I just need something more than this. What is going on? What's with this? going Doug? on? You there, Doug? <laughs> oh, dude, he's lost and then, it. And then points forward. I'm. Uh, I don't know what to do. This dude's had too many drinks. What do we do? Uh huh. And then the what? Bird has landed. Okay, clap two, two, la uh, bomb, two bombs, the nest two bombs. is here. Explode, explode. Two. Okay, two knocks. Birds, birds, dogs. Hey, birds. so this is nothing. What this is, is nothing. And I don't understand. And then I lean over to Felsic. What? Go What's to the dog. On? Oh. <laughs> Wait, you were whistling at me? Oh, no, all them. Oh, okay. Keep going. Yeah. Wait, yeah, so... Uh, is, slick over to the dog. He, <laughs> are you talking to Felsic and not us? <laughs> <laughs> I look back. <laughs> oh, my God, dude. I wrote to the dog. I go to the dog. Rask, did we do something wrong? <laughs> I think he's mad at us. Why are they mad at us? And then I try to, and then I try to get to the hatch. <laughs> okay. Uh, you kind of like climb up the dock a little bit and get to the hatch. What would you like to do now? Um, can I check it for any sort of alarm system? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, investigation uh, will, uh, investigation check will do that. All right, 15. Uh, so as you're kind of like looking around the door, one thing you definitely establish is the hatches sealed shut and locked. Um, as far as your investigation goes with the skill that you've presented, you do not detect any traps. Um, and then I guess I want to look at the, the locking mechanism. How hard is this thing going to be to open? Uh, so uh, you will require either thieves tools or tinkers tools. I have those. No, I have those. Shh. Uh, what is everyone's <laughs> passive perception, by the way? Passive. Uh, what does uh, it show my on here? Passive perception is like ten. Yeah, it's. 10. Is that just like your flat wisdom, basically? Uh, it it would be if you are if you if, don't have uh proficiency in perception. Correct. It would just be your wisdom plus ten. Okay. 
Nice oh. one, T's in perception. Mine is quite low. Uh oh. All right then. Is uh, anyone <laughs> taking watch? Or are you all just? I don't think there's any way the bomb wouldn't be taking watch because he has no purpose in like the infiltration thing. He's not good at that. So okay, right. my passive perception is eighteen. Ooh! I had to check. How did you pull? How did you? How? I've had expertise on perception. You have expertise on perception oh, with, with a 10 wisdom. God damn. Holy hell. <laughs> All right. Excuse me one second. Damn, the two of us on watch. Badass. <laughs> uh, two eyes between us. I would start uh, working my way in if uh, you, want, yes. you want me to do a tools uh, check. Oh, yeah. So uh, first, let's go ahead and get uh, perception checks from the bomb and Drask. Since you guys are actively uh, taking watch. Okay. Okay. I have a question. Yes. If I try to sniff it, I get I get advantage because of <laughs> Mido right now. Uh, yes. So if you use Mido uh, as binoculars, <laughs> yeah, you get advantage. That is absolutely correct. Cool. What the fuck gonna, are you doing? I'm following Mido's lead on this one. They're on to something. Okay. I got 15. I'm going to add a D4 to it with my talisman. I got 27. I got 16. All right. Um, as you look around, uh, you guys are currently located like right here. Uh, the guards are patrolling over here, but they will probably be returning soon. Probably within the next half hour is what you would uh, uh, safely assume with the usual pattern. But right now, it seems the coast is clear. Uh, as far as tool checks go, Zug, uh, any check you make currently to try and pick, uh, I will give you some options. Uh, you can uh, take one minute to try and break your way through the submarine hatch. The DC will be very high as you're trying to quickly do that, and the cost of failure will also be high. Uh, you can try and spend 10 minutes uh, to, to try and break through the door. The DC is going to be a bit lowered, as well as the punishment of failure. Or you can try to be as safe as possible, but that'll take you 30 minutes. That'll be your lowest DC and your lowest risk factor of punishing failures. What would you like to do? Um, I guess first I would look to the two lookouts and, and just simply say... What the fuck? And then eagerly wait a response. Bob uh, just uses like fucking like minor <laughs> illusion to write out the words 30 minutes maximum. <laughs> oh, yeah. I throw up the and okay hand. I throw up the okay hand. I go for the 10 minute option, Brett. All right. Uh, go ahead and uh, yeah, give me a tools check. Let's see. Uh, let's see what you do. Come on. Um, I don't see my. This is it just the engineering tools? I thought they were called something different. Uh, give me one second. I thought they were like a certain. Yeah, edu uh, engineering tools is fine. Wait. Wait, I don't have any pluses to it? Yeah, uh, it, it, it. Something's going on with the character sheets where it's not adding any of the bonuses for some weird fucking reason. So. Give me one second. Is I do. Put his clothes back on? Yes. Nobody <laughs> left. He put his clothes back on. <laughs> Oh, they were maybe, on when he was throwing dirt at the fire. Uh, I'm going to roll something. Uh, this is not going to count as your roll. Excellent. So that looks way better. Eight. Uh, what's your intelligence? Five. So why? So you, you should be getting like a plus 13, correct? Um... Yeah. yeah, I'm, I'm going to add I'm going to add your bonus because for some reason expertise isn't working for whatever reason. All right, I'm going to do another check. This, OK. Uh, oh, there we go. All right. All right. OK, uh, go ahead. Now you make the roll and we'll use that as your roll. OK. Ba -boom. Ba -boom. Ooh, baby. So after, so after 10 minutes, uh, you kind of like are going in with all the servos, just kind of trying to figure everything out. And, uh, and yeah, let's see here, doing this, and you're going boop, 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 and, uh, you will, uh, hear the sound of the door going, as it just opens up after 10 minutes. Nice. Jesus. Points down the hatch. Okay. 
and tries to and tries and tries to hurry everyone. All right, move. Now Ooh. that you have now that you have overridden the hatch, uh, you can easily close it from within. Oh, this will be our tomb. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I close the hatch once everyone's in. All right, once you close the hatch, anyone with dark vision is now in a pitch black room. Hell yes! Imagine oh, not fuck. having. <laughs> and it's all you hear is the sloshing of the water from underneath uh, but otherwise you can't tell what direction you're in it's just a pitch black iron tube alright this is great and that's people without With, without vision? dark vision okay. without dark vision yeah, we just see black and white uh, I give uh, felt like my goggles <laughs> don't bump yourself there's something right there yeah I found it <laughs> yeah. Hey, put these on. Thanks. Okay, thanks. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Does Bo have dark vision? Uh, yes. As a okay. rackling. Sick. Yeah. Uh, all right. So, uh, the Himmel class submersible. They have a chance to look around. Uh, it is a speedy, maneuverable underwater vehicle designed for fast travel in waters up to a thousand feet in depth. The submersible can safely carry six small or medium-sized creatures and ten cubic feet of cargo. It has a swim speed of a hundred feet underwater. So, now you gotta figure out how to turn on the damn thing. I'm gonna start making my way down the ship and trying to figure that out. Is there like a button? Uh, so, uh, it's gonna be the same thing. Uh, all right, so here's your options, Zug. You can either hack uh, the panel to try and just have like your computer like control it the way you want to, uh, or you can try and spend some time to actually try and figure out how the whole thing functions. How would you like to go about and do it? it? Mm. Keep in mind that hacking into it does risk leaving uh, breadcrumbs of your, you know, tampering. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There's nothing outside that really gives us that much of like an urgent, like 10 minute time limit now, right? Because we visually yeah. on the outside just yeah, look even like Even if they the patrol, sub. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why I, I don't know what the time difference between between the two options is, but um, I mean, ultimately you get to choose what you'd like to do. Um, those are the three options though. Uh, so if, well, so you could either rush it or try and take your time. Um, but as far as trying to figure out what it is, if you're hacking into a system, um, you may leave what, what's called like little breadcrumbs, which mm -hmm. kind of shows like you have been there, you know what I mean? And then it could potentially track back to you. Meanwhile, yeah. learning how to like navigate and move it on your own without hacking into it is possible. Uh, it's just going to be more difficult because you've never really used a submersible before, so it may take more time and the DC may be ha ha uh, higher. Yeah, I think Zug's curiosity and the intention of us to actually use this thing for more than just like a joyride. Um, he would want to understand the inner workings of it a bit more to kind of dissect the... the the sub, so he knows, like, if he needs to call something out for other people to do, he can explain it to them. So Understood. he's going to take his time. All right, so mm -hmm. I will give you uh, three options for this. Uh, you can take an hour to try and figure out how the submersible works. You can try and take four hours how to make the submersible work. Or you can take eight hours. Less time, higher DC, higher uh, failure chances, uh, or higher higher uh, fa failure uh, consequences. Uh, more time, lower DC, uh, lower risk. Sorry, what were the three time options again? One hour, four hour, eight hour. Hmm. I think I want to be a little centrist again, I think. I reckon. Do a little. We would still be out here before 6 a.m., which is the earliest I imagined someone would want to use this fucking thing. Okay. If even want to. So, yeah, I'd spend about four hours on it. Understood. It is now four in the morning. Uh, go ahead and give me a investigation check. Bum, bum. It's starting it's to stink in just, here. Oh, it's just that easy. I mean, oh, this thing is just controls and buttons and beeps and bops. 
Uh, you look at the manual that's been left behind within here and kind of instruct everything that's going on. You do see there's sort of like an easy mode uh, that is typically used for uh, consumer use. <laughs> so it, it just everything's kind of a little more automated. Um, you have a little less control of the sub, uh, but it kind of gets you around there. Or you can kind of go in a more manual mode where you have more control of what the sub can actually do. You can kind of control uh, the speed a little bit better, how well you accelerate, all those kind of things. And that's kind of what you're start starting to tamper around a little bit with. Um, so uh, as you do that, uh, you will also find, uh, thanks to that investigation check, uh, the owner decided to keep the passcode uh, that was printed in the manual uh, still in the manual. So unless he changed it, all you have to do is type in the code, and that should activate the submersible. Ooh, I give it a try. Beep, boop, beep, beep. Uh, you hear the submersible power up, and there, uh, for anyone that has uh, no um, dark vision, uh, the sub begins to kind of illuminate out with these fluorescent lights, and you're just you're just gonna hear like like the submersible say. Ready for submersibing. Submersibing. <laughs> <laughs> what a strange term. It's high in submersible and party on. <laughs> Hell yeah. Party I love on. this thing. Hell yeah, that's an party open invitation. On. Let's rock the ocean with the ocean. Right on. <laughs> Dude, I love submersibles. Can we keep this thing? <laughs> no, you're going to return it, I think. I mean, oh, it kicks I, ass, I though. To... I need to leave an IOU upstairs though, before we leave. Oh shit! Okay. Do Make it, it quick because we just turned it, it on and the, really the guards will see. Let's go ahead and tank it and tank it. I'm. Well, they'll probably just know that we're gonna return it. It's fine. Yeah, they'll know. Okay. Uh, I undock and proceed to go forward. I'm not going under yet, but just forward. <laughs> you just kind of hear the bubbles <laughs> of the sun. <laughs> Just kind of like ready to go, like you're on a, you're like in a fuck it, like a little boat in your uh, like bubble bath, and you're just ready to ready to go with it. So, all right. <sighs> so yeah, just kind of like departs a little bit from the dock and kind of like bobbles a little bit. Uh, you do see where it is the sort of like tiny iron tube, so you can't see out of it. Um, you are able to activate a couple of settings specifically uh, to turn on the front visor. What that does is it actually sh kind of like shows you what is outside without there being an actual window. So cameras in the front of the sub are kind of like reporting, okay, this is what is you see in front of you. And the visor turns on to the front half of the ship. Ooh, pretty. Kind of like, and it kind of flickers wow. a little bit as it over there. Um, I'm going to take us probably just northeast and, oh. you know, okay. get us around the island. I don't want to go through the, uh, what is it called? The Midrush. I want to go east and, and take the open water. I scream, oh, you scream. We all scream for a submersible. <laughs> yes. Oh my God. Yes. <laughs> cool. All right. Uh, yes, uh, Lena. Oh no, I was asking, if, is it that like a button or is it already automatically on and we can see? Uh, yeah, no, I'm, I'm assuming uh, to so you can actually see your way out. Zug already set all that up. Ah, okay. Yeah. And you can see it's almost like it's 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 like crystal clear, like almost as if you're seeing it, but you're not feeling like the wind or the cold blowing your face. Meanwhile, it was a pretty uh, cold evening out uh, over in Europa. And as you enter and now that the submersible is on, uh, the temperature begins to sort of like heat up a little bit, kind of making it into a very comfortable oh, uh, nice. temperature. Are they heated seats or not? Automated temperature. Yeah. Mm. Tell me, submersible, where is the comms officer station? <laughs> there is no response. <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> um, no, there's a control panel there, but it, you know it can hear you, right? It can't hear me? No. Destination arrival complete. Oh, oh wait. I understand. Uh, uh, Brett, what's the status in microwave? Is he awake yet? I don't want him to miss this. 
<laughs> He's sleeping in your little pocket. Hedgehogs sleep a How long know, time, by Brett? the way. How do you know? What did you say I was yelling? I'm what? microwave. I'm Hedgehogs microwave. Hedgehogs sleep for like 16 hours. What the fuck, Brett? I didn't know this was the fucking, <laughs> this was the deal. Okay, fine, 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 fine. He's asleep. Sorry, continue. Or you Thank can you, wake Brett. him up like a monster if you want. No, I, I could you never. do this. I wouldn't <laughs> do that. I wouldn't do that. All right. He is good. missing this. Location arrival completed. Over here? Well, no. Did I open the door? No. Whoa. No. Oh. No. Let's put on a no touchy door rule. Um. New rule established. No touchy door. Wait, Silence. he can totally hear us. Silence, you. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> Where is the station for comms? Error. No comms station available. Submersible. We got a bathroom in here? Hey, what's seven plus two? You're not going to get this one. Calculating. I go south. <laughs> Man, he's taking a long time with that one, huh? Never going to get my bathroom answer now. Sorry, my bad. Uh, dr Jurassic Park. <laughs> I really got to go. It's, it's also rules. deeply so concerning. Just go right there. It's just stay still right there. calculating just go to the, the fucking map. side. You know what I mean? And just equipped with four waste tanks that you can do four? your business. You oh. said four. For what? What? Probably like toilets or something. I'll oh, look for oh, whatever there's four of. On the side over there, we won't look. Calculation complete. Nine. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> took you long enough, eh? Hey. Oh, we got it right. <laughs> Big fan of our new character we have in this campaign. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? All right, oh, wait, so where, wait, wait. where are you going? Yeah, yeah. As we're hitting the open sea as well, uh, I'm going to try our first baby dive. I'm going to send it down about 10 feet under the water. Yo, 10 of them. Confirm yeah. 10 of those big boys. 10 feet dipper. Are you ready to go? Uh, yeah, I'm ready to go. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's yes. why I said I'm going down. Go down. <laughs> All right. Calculating. And then you're going to And thank you, Submersible. <laughs> you're you're doing great. You're going to watch as the sub begins to dip a little bit, and then it, it ends up underwater, and you can kind of see the uh, the water break as you're not even completely <laughs> underneath the water yet. Both throws up. Dive 10 feet. Oh, my God. Got new sea over in the cabin. Someone very clear. <laughs> I'm going another 10. Yo, all right, let's easy all, tiger. Let's all calm down. Slow down. <laughs> a second here. How deep is the ocean? Like 60 feet? Right oh. out to the nearest unit, going down 50 feet. And you're just going to watch as it Whoa. just continues to go down and then dips uh, over to the, the 50 feet mark. There you begin to kind of see a little bit of sea, this sort of like fluorescent seaweed. Uh, kind of like brushing around in the waters. You see a little bit of loose debris from other ships that have been passing forth there. And if you look off to the uh, west, uh, you'll see this big giant metal tower uh, where you can assume that is part of the metal manufactured islands that is part of Europa. Oh, I see. They're like on stilts. That makes sense, I guess. How'd they make the stilts? They um, put them in the water. But, marvel of uh, human engineering. God, it's too bad we're going to like go all the way down to the bottom of the ocean and none of us know what depressurization is or pressurization. <laughs> we're just going to uh, fucking die of the bends in like fucking like six uh, hours. Location uh, arrived. Pressure automated. So you don't die. Oh. <laughs> oh. That's, okay. that's kind of you. <laughs> Uh, hey, I, I keep question. Going we're we're going the, all the way today. for the group here. Yeah. Uh, what is our uh, plan if we do run into a clown horse creature? Oh, I could climb out and kill it. This thing does it. It doesn't have weapons on it, right? This is like a party sub. Submersible. Do we have weapons? Uh, I don't answer questions unless you're administrator or captain. <laughs> can you? Can I have? Can I no have? Fuck can I have question say. permission, please? You have to talk to the captain. He's captain, the I'm the give captain, it to you. captain, I'm the captain. Uh, so can you ask me about weapons? <laughs> um, do you have any weapons on board? No weapons equipped. 
Goodbye. I told you guys it's a party sub. This unit is legally not allowed to have weapons. Hey, do you have music? Yep, here I go. Yeah, can you bump it? <laughs> Ooh, that might help. Oh. <laughs> Okay, okay. Ooh, I like that. I like. Hey, oh, hey, I like that. Hey, Zuck, can you ask the? Can you ask the submersible if it, if it has any friends that were devoured by a creature of the deep? Calculation complete. Uh, solutions nine. Oh, ah, uh, we already knew that. Nine bathrooms. <laughs> I don't. Do you know many? Do you get around? Do you know many other submersibles? I'm just a submersible. You're asking me personal questions like a am an entity. That's not me. What are you gonna say? Oh. That's not me. I'm just a machine. You're more than that. Hey, come on. Yeah, that's not fair to you. Now input coordinates South Island near... <laughs> and make it snappy. Where, where we need to go. This way. Southwest. Uh, yes. Un understood. Understood. We'll Todrona! Todrona! T Tadrona. 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 Course laid in. We will automate fuel consumption hey. so you don't hey. be stranded. Hey, Zuck. Yeah. Did we ever check to see how much fuel is in this? <laughs> no. Should we check? Tell the unauthorized user plenty of fluid, and maybe they should look in the gauge sometime. Thank you. <laughs> whoa, whoa! <laughs> yeah. oh, passive aggressive, okay. Every <laughs> AI slowly skews <laughs> towards Boulder, dude. It's only a matter of time till it's slowly opening the doors to this thing. <laughs> God damn, what the fuck? What am I doing? What is this? <laughs> <laughs> Made you a little crazy, Brett, and we love it. <laughs> Hey, are we gonna, uh, can we, like, manage to squeeze in a long rest during all of this? We're or probably gonna, gonna have to, because I'm regulating the fuel. We're gonna be I mean, a We're already slow. halfway there with that four That'd hours we just sat there doing nothing, huh? We're That's just chilling. Cool. Can we are gonna rest, take, like, a point of exhaustion tomorrow. Yeah, yeah I, think, I, I reckon we could sleep slept on... Yet? The travel the between islands, right? Yeah, yeah that's what I got. Some hammocks that you could lay at and get real nice Sick. and comfy. Hammocks yeah, you're in a submarine lie. in the water. Ooh, okay. Ugh. I'll make sure <laughs> we're swaying it just right so you get nice little bedtime time sleep. All, all right. All right. Okay. Um, I'm gonna hit the sack that if. Something happens while I'm asleep. Um, I guess that wouldn't be too bad. Uh, initiating lullaby protocol. I'd be asleep. And you're gonna hear this like soothing, dulcet tones of like the ocean. Does that my breath? Nice. Oh. <sighs> Honestly, it just makes me kind of feel like the waves are crashing into our submersible and just drowning us. I don't really like that at all. I can change the song if you'd like. Yes, please. Yes, please. You need to be a loud user. Captain's gotta give you permission. Huh? Yeah, as loud music. as you got. <laughs> <laughs> what? We should have gotten going, the military one. We should have gotten the. We can still turn back. <laughs> All right, everyone's doing some long rests. That's probably going to be good yes, for everybody. Yes. That would be lovely. Also, I got to heal the 24 points of damage that Bo gave to each of us. Oh, like, a little gift. Hey, we to put the yourself. thing out. Yeah, we used a lot of spells on a bonfire, huh? Yeah, I thought, we were gonna, I thought we were going to rest there personally. That's why I used the <laughs> third level. <laughs> I was, yeah. Yeah. But hey, we're we're sleeping now. It's fine. Everything worked out. All right. Ah. So give me one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, all right. And with your, can't believe you hijacked a fucking submarine. Uh, with your new submersible. Behold, Todrona. Welcome to Todrona. Todrona. Whoa! Totrona. This place looking sick. Yep. Uh, you are by Totrona Island, which is the mm. active volcano, and that's what I'm saying. If you're looking for beaches, they got yes. real sand here. Oh they got my god! Yeah. Yo, good morning, everyone. I'm very excited 
uh, to do this. Can I check on Michael? Wait, is he awake? Yeah, uh, would you like Michael. to poke your little pocket? Is that what you like to do? Yes, please, but I really need to check on him. He kind of comes out a little bit sleepy eyed. He's like, <laughs> Oh. Good morning, little dude. We're off on another adventure. Are you ready? Yeah, that's what right. I like to hear. Uh, because hey, I can Felsic. pocket resume sleep. Uh, okay. Bomb's gonna try to get Felsic's attention while Bo's doing that. Uh, huh? What? Hey, you know what? you can talk to animals. Oh, I know. Um, it's just I was tired last night. <laughs> the I'm gonna, I know. I'm just. I'm just. Food. I'm, I'm just saying. Maybe, maybe before Bo gets too attached, we should find out if this thing's a psycho. Yeah. You know what I mean. I was thinking exactly the same thing. Can Bo hear this or not? The bomb is absolutely whispering it. Is. <laughs> okay. I also just like. I don't know. I also want to find out if it's happy. I don't know if that knowledge would curse me or not is the problem. <laughs> what if I find out that it's actually not happy to be traveling with us and then I just like keep it in my head forever? Hey, well, then all we can do is do everything we can to make their existence here more comfortable. Yeah, you're right. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. We are at our location. Um, I didn't really think about this, but do you think we could park on the sand? Because uh, I don't think we should go into an official dock with a stolen submarine. Submersible. Oh, Submersible. I don't think we can park a submersible on the sand. Gonna be honest. We just like put it next to it. I don't yeah, say that, what about but the yes, you can. You can beach me. Oh, look at that. Anchor. Oh, you can beach me. Cool. 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 Let's do that. Then I we should beach it, and then I can push we'll it back in it. when we're ready. I mean, we could. This thing have an anchor. Deploy an anchor. No, no, Why not yet? <laughs> oh, <laughs> the anchor okay. deploys. There's not even any sand here. Retrieve anchor and go more south, I guess, or whatever. I uh, like Captain. Going? Here we go. Is Brett, can there... you also give uh, Felsic uh, inspiration again? Oh, I can. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Oh, go okay, because the long rest. Smart I understand. Time. Is there any kind of um, like visible bridge connecting the islands in the? Uh, huh? Oh, uh, to that? Yeah. Uh, not exactly, but you. Mm -hmm. It's it's probably safe to assume there would be some sort of boats or rowboats you or can like to get back system. and forth. Yeah, exactly. Okay, cool. Uh, right I'll now, <laughs> yeah, right now, however, you are noticing there seems to be a series of uh, emergency boats that are kind of cr crisscrossing back and forth to Drone of Island. Oh, huh. There seems to be pretty active right now. I wonder what that's about. Um, I don't know how to really find out either. I mean, it kind of... I don't like that there's a bunch of, like, emergency vehicles there, but I don't think they're gonna, like, look twice at us if we just go park on the beach. Okay. What about, like, right Fine. over there? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Let's do it. I'm so you an iceberg. I've arrived. <laughs> Would you like to be beached or you want to stay underwater? Um, let's rise to surface and then deploy anchor. I don't think we want to beach it, right? Roger, roger. We may, do, is there a way that we can hide the submersible so some other band of goofballs doesn't just do what we did again? It <laughs> If you have your security remote, yes, you can. You can type in the passcode and call submersible as long as you're within like a mile. Oh, jeez. Okay, Do cool. One of those? Wait, is that's, pretty, have that? that's pretty handy, but I we do have, have one of those, right? That's Searching good. for the handheld. Uh oh, you left it at home. You don't got it. Damn it. Oops, I left it at home, guys. I can order you a Himmel remote if you'd like. No. This no, is thank divine you. punishment. Would you like me to use the credit card I have on file to order you a Himmel? Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. I think Himmel you should no, do that. No, 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 no
Hey, can we have the card information? Yes, though, can we have it? Yeah, Just remind card? us quickly the what details of the credit exactly? card on file. Uh, yes, please. Uh, Unfortunately, I am unable to give that information to security. You might, you might be someone trying to steal it. Damn it. Damn it. No. What? Okay, whatever. Okay, yeah, we're good. We can listen. We just swim a little bit to shore, like. Yeah, yeah. we swim a little to shore. It's cold. Yeah. Last time I touched the water, I thought I was going to explode. Well, that's why oh, he can't swim. Right. Yeah. Fuck. Someone's gonna have to hold him. I think. I'm telling you, we we can beat you, and then me and Felsic can push it back. Preferably me alone. You know? Yeah, but then how okay, would we what get about it just back a little bit of beach? Like, okay, kinda, a just, little bit of beach, well, it can't hurt. It can't hurt. Yeah, but then someone's like, going to see it, then they're going to steal it. Like, just the tip. Just Only the if tip. they could push it back in. Oh. I don't think anyone okay, else well, can. Okay, what, well, what if I oh. turn into a big bow, Most and then uh, a bomb good. gets on me, and then we go to the beach, and then we're all going to swim, and everything's fine. I'm fine with any huh? option that doesn't involve me touching the water again. Okay. We're going to beach the tip. Let's go. Beach the tip, okay. Be beach the tip, so like, like my captain said, here we go. Uh, and so yeah, you're gonna kind of like surface a little bit, and you're gonna like brush up right against the beach until it gets dry. Um, and then the, the smush will be like, Captain, we've arrived. You want me to deploy the door? Uh, yeah, drop anchor, deploy door. Um, get would comfortable, you, cause we'll be back. Would you like raft? You have a raft? Whoa! Uh, okay. Raft. okay, I think we should Are go you back. Kidding me? Yeah, we got a little, little emergency raft in case he's stranded. I can deploy it if you want. Um, well, we're already on the beach now. But it's great for future use. Do not deploy. Let's go. Understood. Bye bye. Bye bye. Are you, okay, bye. Are you turning me off? Um, sleep mode. Sleep mode active. Night night. Bye. Night. I pat the console. Uh oh. Uh, you'll watch as the, the as the lights slowly dim in the sub while the door is deployed open, and then the lights just completely shut off. Cool. Hold it. I you think we should have like set a password or something just in case someone else comes aboard and they like you know. Oh, don't it. worry. Most I take the manual with me. <laughs> Most people will also assume that if there's a docked sub, that the owners are just around the corner, just waiting for a chance to catch some kind of criminal. Huh, okay. I'm taking the manual with me that has the passcode in it. Okay. And you will arrive beached right here uh, over in Tetrona Island. And that is where we'll wrap up today's session of Sick. Pipe Dreamers. I agree. So we much for made pride. it. We did it! God damn! We actually, wow, did that something. went really well. I can't believe none of that backfired at <laughs> <Not> once. <laughs> yeah, that's like rare for us. We'll see. Rare, rare wins. Well, you guys rolled pretty well. I was, I was well. begging for a backfire this entire <laughs> time. I was like frothing at the mouth, like, I'm sorry. "Yeah, bomb, go back, place your IOU. Go on, <laughs> come on, please. I need to feel alive. Let's go." <laughs> All right. Uh, Normally, this is the point where we would do uh, fan art, but I have to end the session a little bit early due to uh, it's okay. personal reasons. But Understood. Yeah, absolutely, dude. Uh, but Thank you so much for the session, man. Of I, course. I, I miss you guys. Of course. Uh, but uh, we shall continue next Thursday. Does that sound uh, good with you guys? You got it, man. Let's see you guys then. All right. See you guys later. Bye-bye. Right, thank you, Bye. 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 Bye.